I scared him. <laughs> Look at him get that chicken nipple though. I'm not doing it. They're getting big. They're probably a week and a half now. Give me a second, I'll get one. Possibly. I can't come here. Come here. Yeah, it's okay. There we are. Look at this little cutie. Isn't that cute? Look at their little eyeliner. I really, really like Speckled Sussex. They're so cute and they have such sweet personalities. Oh, hi. Anyways, this is just a short update um, on the chicks and watching them grow. I hope everyone enjoyed it. There you go, bud. You gonna fly off or are you gonna go down the stairs? There you go. They're just so cute. And they do like their little out area. They like to play around. Here we are with the Sussexes, the adults. Um, is, if you can notice, uh, we're missing two. They passed away yesterday. I really want to say it's from the heat. Uh, we got some good shade on them. And they're doing really good now. A lot better anyways. Uh, looking pretty, pretty happy. I threw in some hay earlier and they tore it up, tore it up and shredded it. So I'm probably going to bring some more today. I think it helps keep the ground cool for them. Let's go check in on the barnyards. Here they are. Cage is a little too short for me to get in there, really. I laid a couple eggs on the ground for me, ignoring their nest box, of course. And those are uh, a barnyard mix. We got them from Tractor Supply, and honestly. They only got like two pounds. They're only like two and a half, two pounds. I don't know why. They're supposed to be a leghorn. They're supposed to be an Australorp. I'm going to show you all <clears throat> some of these plants. Here, if y'all remember, I trans I planted those bulbs. This is those bulbs. They've been, honestly, pretty eaten up by grasshoppers. I fight them off, like, every day. I'm trying to save them. I don't know if they'll ever make anything. This jade plant is putting off some babies. Looking good. If any of y'all know why there's some white on the leaves, I'd love to know. Yesterday in the garden, I took some cuttings from some of our tomato plants since they're fixing to die out, and I figured I would root them and then plant them for fall tomatoes. These four are mushroom basket, and these three are a large red cherry. And then this is a peach tree cutting I'm hoping to root. I did dip them all in rooting hormone, and then... Uh, put them in these cups. They're real moist. And then here we have Nasturtium coming up. Nasturtium. And then hopefully we have another one or two. And then here we have no, Brussels sprouts coming up. And then the Vera Lavender so far has not come up. Although look at all these weeds, right? awesome. <laughs> and 
anyways, uh, that's, that's about all for our video today. Really appreciate y'all joining us, even though it's just a short little video. Um, this is our vlog, and I am so happy to share everything with y'all. Um, if y'all like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you want to uh, join for our future videos. A lot of them are a little more informational than this. But uh, we really enjoy y'all's support. See y'all next time. Bye.